This weekend, people will see a phenomenon in the sky. It's going to be beautiful out there as the moon will block the sun during the day. The sky will turn dark on us. It's going to be a fantastic sight. It's called an annular eclipse. And here to tell us a little bit more about it is all the way from NASA astrophysicist Nicole Cologne. Good morning to you. Good morning. Tell us about this phenomenon that's going to be happening over us this weekend. Oh yeah, absolutely. It's such an exciting time because these eclipses don't happen that often from, you know, that we can see here in the US. And so what we're seeing is the moon blocking out um, part of the sun. And so you're going to see what looks like a moon taking a bite out of the sun, which is really uh, just a fun experience to view. So for us, it's going to be a partial eclipse here in Atlanta, but over to the west of us, they're going to see the annual eclipse. And there's this thing called a ring of fire that they'll see. Tell us about that. Yeah, if you know, you're know you not in the path of what we call totality, what you can actually see is the moon block most of the light from the sun. It doesn't block everything because it's just not quite at the right distance from Earth, but it'll block most of it. And you'll see a bright ring of the sunlight still coming through, and it looks like a ring of fire literally in the sky. Can't wait to see that. Now to view it, you're gonna need these special glasses. Can people just wear regular sunglasses or do you, do you need these special glasses to view it? You do not want to wear regular sunglasses to view the sun, actually. Yeah, so you do want to protect your eyes. You don't want to look directly at the sun. And so you can get certified eclipse glasses um, like these shown here. And what you have um, with these glasses is they offer you the right protection to view the sun directly. And you can um, access these glasses at places like your local public library, for example. All right, and quickly, last question. Next year, there's going to be, in April of next year, as a matter of fact, will be a total eclipse. What's the difference between the annular and the total? Yes, so with the annular, we see the ring of fire. We see a bright ring of the sun still when the moon blocks the sun. But in April, we'll see a total solar eclipse, so the moon will completely block the sun. Basically, day will turn to night <laughs> immediately, and uh, we will only see the wispy outer atmosphere of the sun at that point. So it's it's incredible how much difference uh, a few percent makes when blocking the sun. Got it, got it. Thank you for everything, Nicole, this morning from Aunt, uh, from NASA reporting to us, and I uh, really appreciate that. Tomorrow takes place at least here in the 11 o'clock hour. We'll peak right around 1:12, and then it should be ending by 3 o'clock. So we'll be looking at it with protective eyewear. Thanks, Nicole.